watching today we're doing a shoulder uh, patient A has come in complaining of pain in uh, pec minor here rhomboids scapular pain and pain in the actual shoulder joint itself so one two three very big areas that we need to get rid of so um, this will be fun <clears throat> all right so first of all you know take care of the pain in the back of the shoulder You use these <clears throat> wonderful twin points in the palm of the hand. They're not very nice. So we'll use the guide tube to put them in. They're excellent for anywhere the shoulder basically here 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 shoulder pain especially that, that niggling oh i've got this pain right here in my back it's dynamite for that okay as far as i've worked out it's pretty much the only thing that does work so very valuable Bladder 65, mainly because it's shoestring point of the bladder channel and most people will mistake small intestine channel problems with the scapula where mostly it's the muscles beside it, which is of course the bladder channel. Can you uh, move your arm around and see how the back of it feels? So we've only just done the scapula. Yeah, it's not wide at all. Yeah, can you do it across here like this? That's gone? Yeah, that's all right. Perfect, all right. Where are you still feeling the pain now? Well, there's no pain at the moment. <laughs> Happy days, but we know that there's still a problem here with the pec and we still need to do the shoulder as well. So, <clears throat> feel it more mostly here? Is that where you're feeling it? Mind out. Up through there. Ah, pec major, not pec minor. All right, that sounds fair enough. So, traditionally, we'd think, well, the lung channel runs up here and comes into the pec. We've got lung one and lung two right here. Can you see that in the, the things okay? Lung one and lung two right here. However, <clears throat> you put the shoe stream point in to help with that problem there, and uh, you'll find it most likely won't work. Um, something I got off uh, Bob Doan, clever man. <clears throat> you take it across from the shoulder here, and so we're going to use points around the shoulder here that should take care of that. The only problem is, is that once we put them in, we can't get him to move his arm around, so we go the other side. Notice even though I said we weren't going to use the lung points there, obviously the points on the hands here are lung points and we're pretty much on the lung channel there anyway. <clears throat> so we're just expanding the image, covering the, uh, the full area there. Okay, could you roll your arm around again and see how that feels? 
This yeah. time, think about the pack. Is there anything on the pack? No. Perfect. All right, good stuff. All right, now we'll just do something generic that I like for the shoulder. <clears throat> As you know, front of the shoulder here, lung, middle of the shoulder here, large intestine, back of the shoulder here, small intestine, same job. But when we have a look at the, uh, the tendon charts, because obviously most shoulder problems start with the tendons and extend into the muscles, the actual Yang Ming large intestine covers so much of this whole shoulder and I found that by using the Yang Ming channel on the leg works so much better than messing around with the small intestine and um, lung channels for there. So um, <clears throat> we use the knee for the shoulder. Seems these points are dynamite. Stomach 36. That's all the way in, that's four centimeters in. Superficial needling in stomach 36 is insufficient to raise the chi to the shoulder. So, stomach, that's large intestine. Gallbladder, Sanja. Spleen, lung. So they're the, they're the correlations between the leg channels and the arm channels <coughs> for the shoulder. So this would be for, yeah, Sanja large intestine lung channels for the shoulder. So here, can you pan up on me for a sec? The knee eyes are like the eyes in the shoulder, here and here, okay? So if someone's got joint pain, it's like, oh, it's killing me right in the joint. Go into the knee eyes. Put, put three needles in there, three needles in there. It works. If that hasn't got rid of it, come around to the front of the knee here. You can put 10 needles in here. It'll get rid of the, uh, it'll get rid of the, um, the ache and pain in the shoulder joint itself. If it's going up into the top of the shoulder, expand your image here. Expand your image further up. If it's in the armpit, Use the back of the knee, so just imagine this entire joint here is actually the shoulder joint itself and use all the channels and the holographic imagery accordingly. So but that's what we're going to do there today. So this pretty well much covers the muscles in the shoulder. We'll just do the shoulder joint as well. Yes, this is wonderful for knees. And it's even better for shoulders. So, that's a basic treatment of the shoulder pain that we had today. And uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.